you finish cross table and also we start head mount. I think it come out really really nice. Okay, it is time to turn this and start preparing second slide. And remember, wear the glasses. Okay, nice. This one is also really nice and happy. Guys, I just figured this out that this call have no connection with this oiler. They are not connected. Yes, there is no any connection. Chinese. I will try to somehow take it out. But probably it will be damaged. I I am saying about this oiler. Uh. Okay, I will do not remove it without damaging. So the best way is to use screw.
Hey, I have this reverse hammer. I will try to use it. Yeah, it's moving. <laughs> totally no connection. Another thing I need to correct. They are very close each other. So probably I will drill this one a little bit more and we'll be okay. Okay, let's see if I will be able to fix this screw. Yes, I can see. Now I have connection. Now it's bad. Okay guys, I think that this part is already finished. We have grooves on each side, also I cleaned um, holes, oil should be able to get to the grooves. I need to replace this oiler, this grease nut, but I will do this, I, I don't have one now, so I need to wait and buy something. In the internet, I will do this next time. Probably when I will be mounting this table to to the milling machine. But basically, this part is done. I think. Okay, why am I doing this? I have two reasons. One it is lubrication, and second one it is cleaning. Lubrication, I mean if I will use pneumatic greaser or any kind of greaser, hand one or manual one, I don't know, any one, and I will provide grease or oil here to this hole. If I have no grooves, I have only ma a small scope covered by oil and I need to turn this on si from side to side many times to make sure that whole surface is properly lubricated and usually it's not so I made grooves and oil will be able to travel in that grooves to whole table and if I will move this table in this direction like this grease from this groove or oil, whatever, will travel here and this surface and this surface will be covered by grease. Also grease from this groove will come out and grease this surface. So that is the reason first, that is the first reason. Second one, cleaning. If for example, some chip will come here. I don't know how it could be the dirt, sand, I don't know, chip will stick to this oiled surface. And if this chip will get to the groove because I move table, here it have had tension and pr pressure and stress on it because these two surfaces are very tight on each other. But here he, he, these chips will be had space and probably will stay in groove. 
So this groove will be cleaning surface from dust and ever any particular will get there. So this groove will be also have cleaning option. Uh, because when I will move it, uh, chip will come here to the groove and stays there because of they have l more space. And when I will use pneumatic uh, grease gun, another time to rubricate this again and put their new grease, I will be able to push it out from this surface and out from these grooves because this, these grooves so longer than white table so cleaning option is also very important okay we have here head mount i'm not expert i don't know really how to call this in english head mount head support and here we have slides and this is sliding on column to add use this we are using using uh, something like this this acting like like the wedge so we are it should be mounted here but in practice usually this part is not working well and also it's made a little bit rough I don't know if you can see this this edge is very sharp really very sharp And I need to debut it. Uh, how this wedge is working? Here we have place for uh, head of the screw. The screw is located here in this hole. And position on the screw is holding this adius bar, acting as a wedge. If screw will be deeper more clamping force we have here because this part is thicker on one side and thinner on another side so but usually in theory this should work but usually it's not it's not working well and i want to add additional holes and bolts to this part and made more bolts like this in different shape and, and little bit different but similar little bit different but similar function because this this adius bar should act as a wedge but usually is not so i will add more bolts like this to press to push this adius bar against column and also take a look how poorly this is a machine exactly in this place this place is the worst place of this part take a look Okay, I have this drill press, drill stand with adapter for my multi-tool and I will use it because it's high enough. I will use it to make additional holes in this part because as you can see it fit under so it should be should be okay and I will do this with precise I want to Chinese drill bit very cheap for PCB but I am I want to only start so they they will be okay uh, 
I change it to old fashioned really. Okay, I want to make another hole here and I use multi tool dreamer because it's more accurate than my drill and this pilot hole is important so I want to have it done very nice. Okay, we have holes drilled. I drilled them with drill 6,8 mm. It is drill for M8 tap. I have tap here. They are cheapest. This is soft, so it will be not problem. But I lost somewhere my handle. Not handle. My mount, and I don't have any key. To, to tap this, so I think I will make one. Perfect. Bingo. Nice! So if you don't have tool you always can make your own tool. Not always but usually. I have modified my tool. Now it's full professional. I think I can go on eBay with that. It is tap maker 2.0 2.0 or whatever you want. But now, yeah, but yes, now it's full profi, professional tour. Uh, I can sell you one if you want. Let's check if it's working. Yeah. Nice and easy. If you want one, write it in comment. Woo! Easy. Tap maker is really working. This tool is not perfect. It has child age problems. For example, this is not hardened and soon I will be forced to do new one, but it's working. Almost finished. Ah. Yes. Okay. We did it with my own tool. Ready to sell. Nice. So third, finish one. Should go easy. Okay, last one. I am almost there. Yeah, it is end. Few turns and I will be. I will finish. Nice. Okay. Number three. Finished up.
Okay, now all holes have threads. Awesome. And in tool review part, this ergonomic shape is still not aluminium. Nice, really nice. So ergonomic shape, rocket science steel, I can say 10 points. And most important, made in Europe. I will finish head mount and also I will fix replication there and after that I will install it on column.